How's it going everyone? Welcome back and today we are going to talk about your iPhone app store is stuck at loading and you literally can't find any apps or you can't even do anything. If you keep getting the loading screen right on your iPhone app store then here is how to troubleshoot it. Before you do anything else, first of all, you have to swap down from the top here and enable airplane mode for about 20 to 30 seconds. After that, turn it off. At the very same time, you actually want to take a look at your internet connection. It can be the cellular data or Wi-Fi, so what I really recommend you to do, if you are using Wi-Fi, then all I want you guys to do is just simply turn off your Wi-Fi from here and enable mobile data and see if that works for you to solve your problem or not or you can do the vice versa you can turn on mobile data and turn in wi-fi and see your loading screen is gone or not now after following this the next thing that you want to do is actually restart your app store now the question is how do i do that in order to restart your apps i mean app store from your iphone you simply can swap down from the top here you can you can simply swap down from the bottom here and come to the app switcher and make sure to remove the app store from the background right after that all you guys want to do is just simply go ahead and open up your settings and this time you want to scroll down to general and you want to scroll down to background app refresh so make sure this feature is enabled and activated with wi-fi and cellular data now the next thing that you want to do you want to just go back here and now you actually need to clear out the cache and cookies so you can scroll down here and tap app store scroll down again and tap personal recommendations and here you actually have to tap on the clear storage now once you come over here you got to tap on clear app uses data and tap clear app uses data from here and tap done okay so after that all you guys need to do is just simply restart your iphone and you're all good to go now most likely your problem is going to be solved after following these couple of steps but still if you have problems last things you guys need to do on your iphone you gotta open up your settings and iphone first you gotta open up your general First of all, you have to take a look at your iPhone updates. If you found if there's new software available or update available, just go ahead and update it. However, if there's no update available, just go back here, scroll down and tap date and time. So make sure date and time is actually set automatically. And lastly, you actually want to scroll down and tap on chance found reset iPhone, tap reset and simply select reset network settings. Mostly this problem happened because of your network, so you can do a network reset settings on iPhone to solve your problems. Or you guys can come to your Apple ID and you can try logging out your Apple ID and try to log it back on. And after that, your problem is going to be solved. Still, if you guys have any more questions to ask, please let me know in the comment section, guys. See you all around.